daily forecast for July 28th by FX Empire. Uh, silver markets, as you can see, gapped a little higher at the open on Monday, came back, filled this gap, and bounced enough to form a hammer. That, of course, that's a very bullish sign. Uh, as it is the second hammer in a row. And then on top of that, we filled the gap. There's no only buyers there. They're turned out to be. So we think what's going to happen in the short term is that this market's probably going to bounce towards $15. So short-term traders will probably be long. However, if we can break above 15, we could go into the next little consolidation area up to 15 and a half. We do feel more comfortable selling though, so any trouble that we run into near the $15 level, we will not hesitate to sell because quite frankly, it's a downtrend. You don't want to fight it. On the other hand, if we break down below the bottom of the hammer, that is a very negative sign, and then we would be a little more aggressive to the short side. Keep in mind, silver is a um, industrial metal, and industrial demand, of course, is going to suffer as China markets, Chinese markets, Shanghai uh, Composite specifically, tanked showing real concerns in China, and uh, as they are the manufacturers of the world, basically, silver just isn't in demand at the moment so really at this point in time we might get a little bit of a relief rally but that's about what we're looking for not a whole lot more than that